Say hello to Birdie, everyone. And that's what happens when you don't say hi to Birdie. So welcome back to Untale Yellow Version, everyone, aka the uh, number zero, uh, unofficial zero, because this is, is a uh, prequel to Undertale, sort of. But yeah, welcome back to Untale Yellow Version. So, um, yeah, we've got. I like her sort of running thing. I like that we've got a companion with us. We've never actually had a companion with us, I'm pretty sure, in the Undertale universe. Any well, I mean, we've had... We've had, like, Rosie, uh, uh, Susie... And other characters with us in Deltarune. But in Undertale, we've never actually had any companions with us, so... Is I don't know it's it's refreshing to see at least, and I'm not gonna lie, I can't wait to get out of the sort of wild wild west area because wild wild west is just not my jam, you know. It's not really my vibe, my style. Hi. It's almost just too busy. Without catching water like that, who could? Yeah. Okay. Fair enough. I'll. I'll leave you be. Oh yeah, we, we went into here before, didn't we? Yes, we did. I remember this. Why can't we go over here? And this, this is a door. It is not a door. Can we... Oh, above the table is a painting of a large... Oh, we're talking about the yellow thing? I mean, it's not really that large. I mean, compared to what? It's almost as if the heat leaps right off the canvas. Okay, hello there. This is Tim from the Wild West, are you? I must say, I haven't seen your face around these parts. Welcome to my abode, young one. As you may have noticed. As you may notice, I have a knack for the preservation of life. I see. Grass is very rare here. Oh! On the right, of course. For any to grow, there must be a source of water close by or amongst the ground. I try my best to keep my own little patch happy. It's one of my many hobbies. Fair enough. So, so the water must be in that can, right? That water can, okay. This is a door, right? It, it definitely looks like a door. When is a door not a door? And don't say it's a jar, because that totally does not work here. <laughs> oh. We are... We, 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 we... Found 30G. In one of the pants. Okay. 30G. It's stealing. But it's still money, so yes, take it. Okay, nice. Um, we'll just be on our way. They'll never suspect a thing. Hi there. Pinch, pinch. <laughs> Beware of my pincers, traveller. Okay. I'll just leave you guys be then. Free hugs? Oh, who would... Who would resist a free hug, huh? Who would resist? Hey, dude. I know you were saying no, but I'm selling free hugs. How can you... St Shouldn't you be offering free hugs, not selling? You can't sell free hugs. Darn it. You already read my sign, in, didn't you? I hate... Oh, don't hate yourself. I mean... That, that's kind of your fault for making the sign, like, readable. 
Pretend to hate yourself for it. Come on, man. Why does this remind me of an area in Yumi Nikki? And what is this? A sapling sits within the ground, near to life and unsure of itself. It is full of potential, but has just to reach it. One day, it might. That's a lot like a lot of uh, humans around here. They're still quite new to life and trying to figure out themselves. I mean, I was like that at one point. I mean, still am, ish. I figured out most of myself, I believe. Anyway, what's this? Oh, apparently it's nothing, okay. Right. Can, uh, are we able to get out of the Wild West? Like, sooner or later, maybe? Um, hi, you remind me a little bit of Papyrus. Oh, oh hey, clever. The, oh, I, you know, I, I, I just for a moment I forgot my name was clever. Remember how I told you I, I apprehended a... This is her, isn't it? This is her. You still think I'm... Your captain did explain to you I'm not a human, right? Please tell me she did. Oh, oh, uh, I'm so sorry. I, I just thought you... No, 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 no. I, I'm sorry. I, I just... I get it often. It's totally fine. You wouldn't believe how many grumpy monsters I deal with. No, 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 no you're a grumpy monster, of course. No, 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 no. I'm sure you're very, very nice. <coughs> anyway, what's your name? Wait, 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 which, which one's awesome? Because obviously, Bird is right next to me, not facing me. But she's already asked my. Wait, has she. Wait, did, did she. Did. She already asked my name, right? She. she... I'm so confused. <laughs> sure, it's clever. Huh? No, no, you. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> you know, that's why I was so confused. Why are you asking me? <laughs> I... Actually, how about... Is it because you're a red colour? I mean, you look a little bit pink. But, okay, yeah, red. That's what your colleagues have kept calling me every time that I get falsely apprehended. To be quite honest, I had that eventually I'd be caught. And I thought you'd all recognize me and it stop. It might just be wiser to join the guy at this point. It might just be wiser. Join? That would be fantastic. I'd be glad to show you the reps of my job. You could even help me build puzzles. That might be a code violation now that I think about it. Oh, dang. Ah, it's fine. What? It can't be that easy to get in, right? I, I, I mean, they let me join. Oh, that winky face. Oh, dear. We'll figure it out. Me and Clover have some important business to attend to, though. But I should be free next week. You can find me doing my dirt. Uh, my. I didn't say dirty. My duty around so in any day. Oh. Y you're serious? <laughs> uh, I, I mean, uh, sure. S sounds like a plan. See you next then. See ya. What was that int? <laughs> what was that? What was? <laughs> what did I just? <laughs> what? <laughs> Should we just go in? Can we go in? Sorry, I'm not home. Then who the hell answered the door then? Yo, what up? What's she all about? Hello, darling. How are you doing today? It's a lovely day, ain't it? 
Is it always this hot and humid, do you think? I just moved here from Estonia, so I'm not entirely sure just yet. But a local like you would know, right? I've got a question for you, actually. Do you develop some sort of spectrum of hot round here? See, like, not just hot, but blazing hot versus sweltering hot. You know what, you, you look busy. We'll talk later, or something. Yeah, definitely not a local around here by any means. Oh, this one's locked off. Ornate gate. Unfortunately, it's locked. So either we're going to be getting a key from that, for, for that, or we're going to be coming from there somehow. Oh, this is cozy. Hello. So that's how much I currently have, right? 48. I'm guessing that's dollars because that's got the S thing, so I'm guessing that's dollars. Hello, traveler. Would you be interested in having your own your fortune told? Only 5G per fortune. Now, you may be thinking that price is a little low. What quality fortune from a experienced fortune teller costs 5G, huh? Well, your suspicions would be correct. See, I'm a fortune teller in training, so I'm... Practice, you see. So I can interest you in a... Sorry... If you change your mind, I'll be here. Otherwise, I may never get better. Thing is, I want them to try and get better, but I also don't want to waste money. So, sorry about that. Cafe! Maybe we could spend a little bit of money off here? The game zone. We're going to be spending money here now. <laughs> right, which. Actually, which game? What's this? I need to know what it is first. You can't just tell me, oh, do you want to play it? I need to know what game it is. Out of order, please stop feeding it. <gasps> oh dear. What about this one? Um. Um. Oh, someone's already playing it. Oh, I didn't realize that. Yo, what do you want? I'm in the middle of a gaming sesh. Oh, you're a kid like me. I bet you're good at these machines. Have you tried that Mew Mew Love Blaster? It's so addicting. I suck at it though. I hear there's a final boss, but I've never actually seen anyone reach it. I bet you could totally kick, kick his butt though. I mean, I could at least try, but you're not gonna let me. Okay, let's just try the pink game then. Hopefully, this is gonna be worth it for 3G. Oh, this is Love Blaster. Oh, but it's pink. Okay, well, whatever. Let's just, uh. I should probably press on help, you know, to help me, but let's just try this out anyway. Oh, oh, okay, 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 okay. Right, so, oh god. Aha, uh aha, -huh, uh -huh, oh, mm, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. I've got three lives, I just realised that. <gasps> yep, I've got three lives, I have three lives, I have three lives. This is bad, this is, no, 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 damn, damn, I'm dead, I'm... I'm playing again. Okay. Right. Ouch. Ouch. Right. Uh, my god. Okay. Right. I... God. I, I'm so bad. I'm so bad at dodging. I... <laughs> I'm so bad at dodging this. What the heck? Okay. So, what does help me? Dash to safety... Give it... Wait. Hold X. Wait, Z plus... Wait, what? Hmm? 
Z plus Uh, uh Okay Oh, what the uh, <laughs> Okay Oh The um hmm, this is um 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 yeah okay so okay I mean Alice is just a, a little bit better <laughs> just uh, just a little bit though oh my god my 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 nose is itching oh my god oh my god mm. how much of, how much I was I love how I died as in, as I was about to say how am I surviving you know what. Not that fun. Not that fun. So I'm gonna leave it be. Hello. I remember this game working more efficiently in the past. The air pressure seems to have been tampered with or something. Considering this table doubles as the AC, that ain't good news. Can I play? With you? Grounded. How disappointed. Oh! You're talking about the table being grounded? Like. Okay. Hello there. I'll tell you something, but I'm on a strike. The only needs better. Uh, that's me, I'm the only. <laughs> okay. Actually, where do I go from here? That's, that's, that's the. Wait, oh yeah, we go this way, don't we, right? And we're going here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. First of all, what's this? <gasps> Bell! Summoning the male person. Yeah! You have a watch? If you don't, that's fine. Because you know what time it is. Mail time, mail time! Awesome. I truly hope that you'd like a mail. As for me, I must have sale. So. What's our mail like? This. I like how long this box is now. <gasps> mail! Shuffler's letter. <laughs> Every single time, man. To our latest Shuffler's recruit. Toast here. Toast? Oh, yeah, because one of them was called Mo, and I'm guessing that this one's Toast, maybe? Or maybe another one is Toast. I have no idea. There's someone out in the wild that we forgot to warn you about. This scruffy fellow with a blue hat. Don't interact with... Blue hat. Don't interact with him or support his end endeavours. I won't tell you why, because this letter reads way cooler as a mystery. Now I'll let Swig finish this. He gets upset when he misses um, out on writing letters. Yeah, I upset Swig. I don't have a blue hat, I have a brown hat, so it can't be me. So maybe they're warm warning me about this Person with a blue hat. I don't know why, but this reminds me of this, this room. Reminds me of um, Sands, like meeting up with Sands at the end of the game. I think. Yeah, that's what. That's what. It, wow, that was very short-lived. How long are we gonna be spending in the wild, wild west anyway? Sorry, buddy. This path is blocked. I am moving no matter what. Anyone does provoke me. You wouldn't understand. Go, boss. But so yourself. <laughs> Saving. Oh, oh, hello. Well. Well, 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 what do we have here? Ah, oh, I left all my G at home. Would you lend me one? Sure. Thank you. Hmm. I wish... That clover would make it back home safely. Aw, oh, thank you. Now you have me. And a wish on your side. Oh, that's... that's that. 
That's very, very sweet of you, Birdie. I don't even know what your name is, but yeah, I'm gonna just I'm just gonna keep calling you Birdie for now. Ah, I see. An oak base with iron nails holding it together. Oh, sorry. I was nerding out for a second. Sure, it's cool wagon. You know what? That's fine. No doubt, all you want. No problem with me whatsoever. And it's quiet. Not concerning whatsoever in the slightest. Huh? Hang on. I think someone's coming this way. <laughs> Reminds me a lot of our night. <laughs> Guys, look here. Someone has. Uh, someone new has stumbled into a humble town. This better not be another joke. Whoa. For once, don't look the like. Don't, don't. For 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 ones don't look like it is. <laughs> How many people? Hey, strangers. Oh, hello. We're just passing through. We mean no harm. We mean no harm. I promise. That's what the last guy said. Let's just say he's the one with the wind now. Oh 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 oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm just kidding around. You were shaking in your boots for a second there. <laughs> you, you, you sure got me. That wasn't very funny, Edward. I can assure you, we are delighted to be around. Nothing you can't handle, I'm sure. I. <sighs> Why do you insist on scaring away every monster you meet? At least Mooch never oversteps her bounds. Never! Um, well, it was a pleasure to meet you for but uh... W w Hold it right there, Missy. I'm up, pals. Whoa. Just with that. Oh, whoa. The name's Northstar, I run this town. Not alone, of course. This fan monster there, Mapaze. Together, we are... The Feisty Five. That's a nice name. Our name stands for... Fearlessness. Excellent. Intuition Sneakiness Toughness Gearfulness Justice Um the J side Right, right, right. Anyway, now that we're all introduced. I'd be glad to give you uh, and your buddy a tour. Uh, hold on. Y your buddy? Are they a human? Um, well, uh, I, I won't say no. I knew it. There ain't no doubt in my mind that this kid is a real, living, authentic human. Sorry about this. I gotta seize this once in a lifetime opportunity. Ed? Fetch me that key. Sure thing. Wait! What are you doing with Clover? Ah, uh, Clover, is it? That's a modified name. To answer your question, Feathers, Clover and I got a turn to run. Don't Feathers me! You're speaking to Matlet of the Royal Guard. I can and will report you to King Asgore for this abrasive behavior. Your royal guard? 
th that's funny because I don't see anything to indicate that. No armor, weapon, badge. I uh, I left it all at my post in Snowden. Please don't bother trying to fool us. He's right. I'm truly sorry about this. I really am. A business is business. Together, we'll be fast as six. The alliteration. Shh. <sighs> Clever. I can't. I can't go up against these guys. Don't worry. I'll figure this out. Star, should we be doing this? Put Martin is upset. Let me best kill Moray. That's the last time something exciting happened around here. Uh, he, you've got a point. <coughs> <coughs> this sounds full of excitement, especially now. Let's go, bud. Oh, and feathers. Welcome to the Wild East. So not the Wild West, everybody. The Wild East. Totally different. Oh. Goodness me. This little fella... This, this little fella here is uh, clever. Hey, Star. What the hell are you bringing a human in here for? Drabbershush! Now, I know what you're, you're all thinking. But trust me. Clover here ain't no green horn. They know what they're doing. Just look at that hat. Yeah. It's brown. Yes, what about that? Actually, this could be fun. Dina, Dina, hit me. Uh, no more heck, heck uh, no, no more heckling from the crowd. Uh, <coughs> <coughs> Ladies and dinner monsters, as Kuroba said, Clover is a human. Woo! I know, exciting stuff, a real honor. Now, I will let Clover tell you all about li their life, but I've been studying up. I'm a bit of a human expert if you didn't know that. Oh great, here we go again. Here we go indeed. Did you know that humans use monsters for tele uh, transportation? Ooh. It's true. Large, four-legged monsters. They put a seat on, on top of them and, and everything. They're called horses, Star. Ah, uh, ah, uh, so, so you, you, you know one of them personally? That's, that's quite impressive. Did you also know that humans are fireproof? When their feeling got accomplished, they wrap monsters straight into a huge fiery... What? <laughs> what? So the monsters burn, right? Most monsters are... Fireproof? Star, are you saying my friend Horses was killed by a fiery sphere? No, 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 um, well, um, well, I'm not quite sure. I'll ask Clover. Um... No. I don't think so, no. See? Everyone's fireproof. Anyways, did you know that? Look, Star. You don't need to keep this up. Because it's all true. Every single word. Ha! Huh, I knew it! I'm pretty darn good, aren't I? You're the best! You're the best, Star! Yeah, the only sheriff for me, yes! Ha ha ha! But I reckon we're done here. Y'all can go back to your daily life for now. As for you, Clover, it's about time you see what this town has to offer. I will give you a personal tour, but 
If there's one thing you have where you come from is freedom. Take your time exploring, talk to the town's folk and enjoy yourself. I'll be waiting here for you. Give me a shot when you're ready to start training. I never agreed to any of this, mate. So, about me sitting back up with you, that's never going to happen. Sorry, not sorry. You there, human. Not really. About what I expected. I apologize for Star's antics. He's really into human culture and whatnot. You show up here and he flips out. I mean, it is quite unbelievable. A few humans have wandered into the underground before, but they never set foot on these sands. My name is Soroba, or Koroba. I'm pretty sure so it's sure Soroba. I'm a friend of Star's, but not part of his posse. They're a bit too rad for my taste. Clover. Welcome to the underground, Clover. I mean, to be fair, y you, you kind of already know that from inside there, but it's okay. Your attire is surprising, I must say. But, um, I will impress you on the matter. I'm afraid Star is going to drag you into his activities for a while. You must have places to go, correct? The castle, the barrier. You probably want to go home. If I'm being honest, I haven't seen Star this ecstatic in some time. Maybe you should entertain... I mean, I understand that this will make him happy, but this isn't exactly going to make me happy, and my happiness comes first before anyone else's, so sorry, mate. He will probably allow you to leave eventually. Mm, I don't think that's going to be the case. It could be, but I don't think so. Well, good luck, Clover. Thank you for your kind words. This, is, this looks like a medical center. It's a bedroom. And not necessarily a medical center. Well, here's the thing. He's not going to notice me, is he? Okay, no, he's not. Okay. Um, I'm going to not be around you lot. Um, I want to leave. Can I leave? C can... Is there a way to... Can, can I, can I please, try and, yeah, oh god, I can't leave, can I? An old necklace, discarded in the sand. Yeah. Okay, nice. Cactus. Not gonna give me anything, okay. Well, looks like I can't leave. Weapon. Two hundred. <laughs> You're too young. <laughs> I mean, not wrong there. Um, heels. Maybe gunpowder edible. Sell. I don't really know what to sell. Don't really want to sell anything. Necklace is a hundred. That's pretty. Valuable tool. Fifty-five. I was hoping you wouldn't ask. <laughs> I apologise, dude. <laughs> Not your lucky day then. <sighs> Young hooligans are as they are. Hooligans I'm forced to put up with to keep my business afloat. They have no respect for the fine arms I produce. Always waving them around like they're some child's toy. However, I have learned to, how to benefit off their behavior. I'm the only monster around that provides such quality weapons, so whenever they push me, I push back and threaten to close the shop. They always crumble and end up paying far more than the weapon they want is worth. Well, at least you kind of profit in that way? Little money is worth a few headaches, haha. <laughs> okay. 
Well, it was nice talking to you. I wish you good travels. I just want out of here. I don't. I, I don't. I don't want to be at the mercy of somebody. Oh, how did I not see this safe point before? Oh, pff, I forgot. Flower comes out when we're alone. Howdy. Jeez, it was like my greeting has found its home. What do you mean? What, what do you mean by that? I like that? It's a disguise. Oh right, okay. Gotcha now. This area is pretty populated, so I picked up and um, picked this up to be fair, to be safe. You being separated from mud that is pretty lucky, but I hope this star guy doesn't hold you here. I'm gonna have to intervene here if he. You know what? As much as I'm not really much of a fan of your presence around me, Flabby, I would not mind that. I would not mind your intervention within a bit between me and Star. I would very much enjoy that, actually. Jail. Marlette. Clover. I know I can count on you. So, me getting out of here, um... Any luck? Soon. Absolutely soon. Let's hope. Thanks for being positive. This is super ridiculous. Anyway. That Sheriff Nostar. Was it? What a jerk. I tried to fight you. Too. I really, really did try. His hooligans were too strong and tossed me in here. Knowing that I don't think force would do much good. There's got to be a level-headed monster around here. One that knows this unjust and will free me. When that time comes, I'll... I'll... <laughs> Who am I kidding? I couldn't press charges for... Or anything. I was so big. But we're concerned. Asko, or another guard finding out about you would be the end. <sighs> well, Nostar seems pretty enthusiastic about all of this. Maybe by playing along we can gain his favour and set me free. I don't know though. Just play cool for now. I'll be here. <sighs> what a day. <laughs> I will get you out of here. I promise, Birdie. And no, I'm not going to call you feathers, either. Even if that's what they call you, I'm not going to call you that. News. Oh god, are we going to find the presidents here? For the fake news? This is a... This, this, this thing has a building for a head. And apparently I can't even talk to it. Apparently I can. <laughs> okay. Greetings. May I interest you in a game of Six Shooter? It is a simple card game of much variety. It costs 3G to play with the potential profit. Intriguing? Intrigued? Mm, not really, mate. Very well. At least, you know what, at least people, these people don't like kick up a fuss if you say no. Like, they're, they're like, you know what, if you change your mind, I'm here. I, I love that attitude. Best kind of attitude. Particularly don't want to be talking with these people because they're part of North Star's posse. So we'd rather stay away. And this place looks like it's a little bit run down. Found sleeping bags is in the corner threatening to restrict it free sleepers. Some kind of berry plant. You notice a few berries are missing. You push the hammock. This way is hypnotizing. Kitchen, one well, nice kitchen. Surprisingly clean kitchen. Impressive. TV. You turn on the TV. This is your favorite channel. White noise. Static. Okay. I mean, should I go back in? I don't want to, but do I like have to? I suppose I should. Is he still here? He's gone. He's just gone. And I'm up here. Everyone is wrapped up in conversation. Quite the popular spot. Good for the... It's funny how like... I interact with them and they're all in conversation and then I stop interacting with them and they just stop. 
interesting. But where is... Where is North Star? I suppose I should just talk to one of his posse then. Hi. Hey, kid. Sorry for being so forceful earlier. I'm just doing what Star thinks is best. This, is, this whole thing is... This whole thing is stack up on us, that's for sure. I'm optimistic about it. I'm glad to hear that. What about you? I mean, you seem to be the nice one of the group, so, um... What's up? Um... About Martlet. I totally uh, get why you'd be upset, but I can explain. I... Think. See, if she is a royal guard, that w would cause problems. Like... She threatened to rep Right. So... <clears throat> being threatened to be reported... To King Asgore... Will send you to jail here. Got it. One thing leads to another and the world is in flames. Well... Maybe. I'm sure Asgore would understand it, uh, but there are others. The head of the Royal Guard, particular. Surely not, right? Surely not. But I can't help but think. But I could be wrong. Hopefully, you didn't have a run in with. I'm confused now. I mean, I, I, mean I, I have another person in mind. Okay, because I, I had I had Papyrus in mind at first, and now she's saying her. So would it be Undyne? Because of course this is in the Undertale. Well, okay, th this is unofficial, of course, but this is, this is in the Undertale universe. So would it be Undyne? Could she be talking about Undyne? I mean, I've never met her. I've just heard we. <laughs> it is Undyne. Okay, never mind. <laughs> that's that, that's fantastic, though. That is <laughs> that is fantastic. Hey, I don't know if you're aware of this, but there's a phone card. My friend runs it while well, I ever see the profits. You should try it. If that's what passes the time, and if that's what I need to, then fine, but at the moment, not really intrigued. I mean, you're not a part of the posse, so you should be fun to talk to. Howdy! You sound literally like Flowey. You got any of that? Any of that good catnip? I can dine and try some. It's what I would say if I were a dirty bandit! <laughs> you were almost tricked. I could go, I could have caught you and turned you into the f Uh... Yeah, be more careful, partner. Okay... Well... It seems like I can't do anything else around here. I mean, there are like maybe a couple more people that I could talk to. Like... Yeah. These people, okay. This town is quite the spectacle. I mean, it's wild, wild. And they said west. I mean, it's wild, wild east. I, uh, spectacle is not how I would describe it. <laughs> I would bury myself in its sand if I could. Yep, yep. Okay. Ha oh, yeah, you're one of. You're one of them as well, okay. Hiya! So, Job, sitting uh, on that stool? I'm feeling you be the talk of the town. We're gonna have so much fun training together. Hehe. <laughs> anyway, see you later. Such fun. I wasn't lying about being close to an exit earlier. I just didn't expect all of this. On the bright side, you may be able to obtain some gear upgrades here. 
This roadblock block isn't totally pointless. Uh -huh. So, are you talking about the weapons shop? Because if you're talking about the weapons shop, it might be a good idea to. But then again, I haven't exactly gone after. Then again, I could spend. No, I could sell the necklace because it is it is quite valuable. I could do that. I might do that. We will see, though. But for now, let's just um. Yeah. Okay. Let, let's just try this game out anyway. I, I don't. Uh, card games aren't really my thing, but I'll give it a go anyway. I'll explain its rules, so listen carefully. A stack of 36 cards would be split into 20. Then laid on the table separately. Okay. There are six card types, each with a different familiar face. You must match cards of the same face, but only if they are touching. Once they are matched, they will be removed from the grid. Two more cards from the reserved. Your goal is to empty the table by matching every card. If you win on in under four, if that in under forty-five seconds, under a minute, you will be rewarded. Okay, any time after that will allow you to break even with. Th if the deck is empty and there are no possible matches left, you will lose with no reward. Yes. Let us play. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is gonna be... This is gonna go terrible. Um... Um... Yes? Okay, okay, okay. We have that, we have that, okay. Actually, this seems... This seems easier than I thought it would be. Um... Um... Ah... Uh. Z- Wait, do I have to keep going? Okay, oh! Well, I'm gonna keep- Oh my, okay. Um... I'm not able. Wait. I'm not able to. Unless this is this. It is? Okay. Yeah. So you gotta do all of that within 45 seconds. Okay. Let's try We're gonna go really, 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 really fast then. Oh my god, okay. Okay. Oh my god, okay. I did. Okay. Um, 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 okay. I. I don't think I'm gonna do this. Although I could do this, I could do this. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm. I'm probably gonna fail. I'm probably gonna fail. I'm. I'm. I'm probably gonna fail. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Come on. Oh my god. I'm gonna. I'm gonna fail. I'm totally gonna fail. I'm totally gonna fail. It said under four five seconds. It literally. He said. So this guy's a scammer then, isn't he? Right? He's a scammer. He literally said 45 seconds. Under 45 seconds. And I would get rewarded. He said if it's over a minute, then I get no reward. Scammer. So let me guess, I've lost my money, right? The I'm going to restart, because just remember, I saved my game before I went into there, so I've, yeah, I keep all of my money, so I, do, I am no longer scammed, but 
At the moment, I'm actually going to take a little bit of a break because uh, it's been about an hour and this video is probably going to be about two hours long maybe. So, um, I will see you all in a mo. And everybody, I am back from my break. So, oh my god, I just realised the uh, music is a tad bit loud in this area. And also, I know that I've been calling our companion Birdie quite a lot. I just realised that her name is actually Martlet. Martlet. From the Royal Guard. Well, she's acting like a Royal Guard anyway. She's not actually a Royal Guard as far as we know. Um, but yeah, her name is actually Martlet. Which we should uh, all remember. This looks like somewhere that I can go down to, but apparently not. So... I've talked to everyone, haven't I? I've definitely... Wait, hang on. What about in here, though? Have I talked to anyone in here? There's nobody to talk to in here. Weird. You haven't seen any cats around. Interesting. There's a hole in the floor. How comfy. <laughs> That's what you call comfort, dude. Okie dokie. Let's just go into the... I mean, it's a hospital, but it looks like a hospital because of the H. Hi there. Welcome to the World East Cl Clinic. Okay. We put the hospital. So it is a hospital. Okay. I was right all this time then. They call me the duck. Are you sick? Hurt? What is your diagnosis? I'm hurt. Yes, of course. We have a tough one. I have just a boost you need. For an upfront price of three. Oh, I thought I said 300G, but no, 3G, at uh, the 30G, I can overcharge your health. It is an experimental medicine, but who said I was qualified? Okay. No thanks. Sorry to hear that. I'll always be here if you need anything. Because you're saying that you're not really qualified and it's experimental, how reliable is the medicine? Would rather, you know, pay money for something that's reliable? If I had a lot of money, then I would pay for it anyway, but because I don't have a lot of money, I'd like to save some. <laughs> Hello? I'm here from... Uh, I'm here for the free... Worry Pops. After I check myself in the dog says he won out I what <laughs> after I checked myself in the doc said he ran out of lollipops yesterday. Oh Bummer at least I have this fluffy bed to cheer me up. Oh. Yep, okay. They're asleep. Several odd smells seep from the dresser. He decided not to inspect it further. What about this uh, wardrobe? A closet with some cleaning supplies inside. They all look brand new. Okay. So, what else am I doing around here then? Two boxes of rubber pellets sit on the desk. Best leave them for someone who needs them. I need them! I mean, I suppose we should just, I don't know, go to weapons? An unfinished game of Go Fish lies on the table. Guess they follow through. Okay, you know what? I mean, should I, should I talk more? Your wares. Ah, oh, yes. My gallery of babies. Uh. Does that sound strange? <coughs> <coughs> These beauties are all crafted from the highest quality materials. I forget them myself in my in my personal gunsmith room. Not only do I make them with care, but I also care for them. I start my mornings by polishing the whole stock until my until I see my reflection in them. I also know 
How to handle these bad boys? I'm a way better shot than North Star, that's for sure. I... I saw a band in my bright rafters. <gasps> visitors! The world is gets many visitors each day. There's something about the aura here that some monsters can't get enough of. You're in your gun all the time, man. Now don't worry. I'm not actually... I'm, I'm, I'm not selling ultra-deadly weapons to any passerby with enough G. I make sure my words are tame enough to not be lethal. I myself am not one for violence. Even though you literally just shot the weapon a moment ago. Well, used enough times as consecutively, but they could be lethal. But then again, a ballet shoe, a, a ballet shoe, could also be lethal. Used, I suppose. Look, don't question my morality too much. I'm not prepared to speak about it. Okay, fair enough. I heard about this town some years back. I had mastered my smithing capabilities and was looking to open up shop. As it turns out, there was an empty building here, so I thought, why not? Seems like quite the perfect town for such a shop. Do I regret settling down here, resulting in endless torment from every from five demonic youngsters? Every day, of course. But everyone else I've met is quite pleasant, so it balances out. Okay. The thing is, the one I mean, I, I thought I'm too young, so I don't think I need anything. Why does it say seven out there anyway? Interesting. Anyway, so let's just exit. Wish you good travels. Thank you. So, hmm, why are we not able to interact with anything over here? I mean, we did interact with something over here. But, uh, hmm. Got junk? Instead of right here at Blackjacks. Today's special, Fancy Horser. Great for defense. Well then, I don't know what else to do. Should I just go back in and I'll talk to everybody? I suppose that's the operative thing to do, right? The saloon isn't always discrowded. It's happy hour, you see? Half price drinks. But you don't know that so they'll continue to sell you full price drinks. Well sh hi there Howdy howdy human take a gander at my wares how tight and stuff is off limits This town Oh this little place it's pretty fun around here I heard it was established some years back when the dunes gained its name if you if, if you get me Maybe I should uh, I should be po polished on this history, but start don't talk about those days. I Wonder why I was looking for a friendly environment to share my brain skills. So here I am There ain't terribly much to do in this town, but that only makes it more close-knit Every day has been pretty predictable until you showed up Is that a good thing or a bad thing? I'm eager to see what Star is planning. I'm not really. You're snakes. Oh, but yeah, <laughs> you're snakes. Oh dear, okay. <laughs> I get this question a lot. These fellows are my pets. They're reptiles, not monsters. Their names are Anne, Sammy, and Bert. The underground still has some critters from the surface like birds and insects. I found these west of here, hiding in a, a crevasse of sorts. Some monsters keep think uh, keep. Some monsters uh, think keeping pets is strange, but I think it's cute. They give me someone to talk to when business is slow. Fair enough. Can I leave? You can at any time. It won't hurt my feelings. Uh, oh, I, I see. Starts trying to keep you here since it's a big deal and all. That ain't right if you're a one to go. I try not to infringe on sheriff business, but I'll ask him about it soon. I'm sure he means well by it. How soon is soon? 
What a character! A oh, big and courageous sheriff. I get a feeling he ain't as tough as he likes to play it up. But then again, maybe he's just clumsy. His whole posse is, is a hoot. They frequently host parties here. He definitely knows the right kind of monsters to surround himself with. Not to mention Soroba, his childhood friend. I got a kick out of her in Star's Antics. When she brings her daughter into town, it's basically two against one, huh? Oh, think about it. It's been a while since I saw the rest of We really need to get the whole gang back together again. So what are you buying? I mean, what are you selling? <laughs> so, root beer, ice water... Heels... No way. I'm not gonna buy anything, just in case. I thought I was there. Is he back? Not back yet. Also, it's Saroba and like still out there. Wait, wait, where'd she go? Oh man, both both North Star and Saroba are gone. What the I smell something fishy. But I suppose I'll just talk to everyone else as well. What do you want? What's wrong? I'll tell you what's wrong. My life's a wreck! Wasted, woeful, washed up! I was supposed to make it big! I was gonna be a big time producer! You know, show business! I couldn't tell you where I went wrong. I thought it hard. I graduated middle school. What else do you want? What else do you need? Stuck my way into gig booking as a joining heartland with potential in my eyes. One day, this robot fella rolled up to me and asked if I've ever produced an artist. Now, I'm a great producer. Make heartbeats on my computer every weekend. I had the talent, but I lacked the vision. I told that one world television, they wouldn't make it in the industry. What an idiot I was. They soon got into the following and totally exploded. Well, not literally. Maybe. Look, kid, I'll tell you this. Sometimes it's like we don't control our lives. Fate has a cruel way of teaching us lessons. Have a little foresight and try not to grow arrogant like I did. Don't you forget that. You know what? You're kind of speaking facts. North Star is the coolest. One time, a construction team was demolishing a building in a new home. But, uh oh, an infant was in the way of, of building as it came crashing down. Suddenly, North Star appeared and wound his lasso up. He wrangled the skyscraper without breaking a sweat. Yeehaw! Yeehaw! For saving his, uh, for saving his life, the building gave North Star one mi wow, one million G. That's quite a lot. True story. True story. Is it really though? You're saying true story. True story. Two times. I feel like that's not much of a true story now. Sorry. Hi there. Are you gonna? Oh my bloody! That, that, that's okay, 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 okay. Make yourself at home. I did not realize that that was North Star. I did not realize that was North Star. Oh my god. I'll come right out and say it. Yes, I am a finger. I came free with the last shipment of bottles. Great. You're clever, am I right? Your name has come up once or twice. You look confused. Oh right, I'm not rhyming. Yeah, that's just a company policy. It gets a little retarded sometimes. But other than that, I have no complaints. It's a great job. Wouldn't trade it for the world. I'm a little worried though. These days, those fancy cell phones are all the rage. I don't know how long the mail service will- Oh me, oh my, our break's come to an end. See you next time. There's a uh, letter. Uh, oh my! Oh my! <laughs> oh god! Okay. See you next time. There's letter to send. 
Why didn't I recognize them? What the heck? I feel like a fool that I didn't recognize them. Damn. Seven monsters are enjoying a nice fair game of poker. How do I keep losing? Oh, that's a bit sad. Well, I guess now we're ready for whatever. Did you talk to the Fat Times Folk Explorer every- Yeah, yes, yes, I did. You're gonna need to if you wanna be good, deputy. That's right, kid. I'm heavily considering you for my cup. Dude, you, you barely know me. You barely know anything about me. And you're already considering me for a role in your posse. <sighs> now don't get too high and mighty just yet. To be a deputy, you gotta know how to wrangle the horses. Me and my posse are gonna show you round. We're gonna show you how it's done round here. I wouldn't drag anyone off the road and give... You wouldn't drag anyone off, yet you literally did just that. <sighs> and give them less treatment. You'll have to prove your, uh, your gunslinging skills to me. That being said, let's go meet up with the others. I don't want to... Why are we at the safe point? All oh, right, everyone, come here. Why is my nose itching all the time? Weird. What's your want, boss? Ooh, are we going to begin training with Clavo? Precisely, Moray. I thought we'd start with a kind of game that involves. I literally thought I said panicking, but pacing. Okay. You mean what I? See you doing every night as I <laughs> back and forth, whispering to yourself. What? I don't, I don't do that. Some monsters have unique ways of getting their thoughts out. Of course. Uh, other monsters. Uh. <coughs> Can anyone correctly guess what game I'm hinting at? Oh, oh, I know. Yes, bitch. A duel. Bingo. Dangerous jewel. Great. No, no! This is all wrong! Oh? What's the matter? Clover doesn't look right. Look at their hat. It's tattered and practically decomposing. And their iron and their holster. What kind of picture is that? Cool Ace. I'm sure they tried their best. No! Oh, Ace has a point. What kind of host am I if I don't spoil you with gifts? To give... Uh, to, oh, okay, okay. Weapon... <laughs> Dress to impress! <laughs> okay. This is all gonna go... Fantastically well. Hehe. <laughs> of course. Oh, Black Giant doesn't like doing business with me. I have to borrow his wares and, uh... Break or lose them. You kinda need to manage yourself a little bit then. Open up, Blackjack. Don't make me use force. I make the law, so I can legally shoot down your doors. Get off my property, Dark Star. I told you I wouldn't even sell you a gumball. Oh, come on, partner. I don't even know what a gumball is. And those last transactions were ages ago. I'm a changed master. Sure. You lost one of my premium revolvers last week. Frolicking in your sandstorm and whatnot. Look, I promise this is a different scenario, Jack. I won't even step inside. You can meet me out here. Oh? Here we go. Oh. Don't worry, Clapper. He's coming. Ah, nice. Okay. Mega Speedy. Oh, of course, sir. I'm just gonna ask you to set a gun to this child. Oh, shit. <laughs> I worded that poorly. Hold on. Set a child, you see. I, I, I was joking. Um, dude, um. You say I'm not a child. Yeah, I literally look like a child. 
It's just a very small, but very tough monster. Um, yeah, small kind of mean child. I mean, you do get small people that are not children. But from this, I'm pretty sure that we are a child. <sighs> I'll give you a 400 G. Oh, wow. Always about the money, eh? Always about the money. Capitalistic. Well, why didn't you open with that kind, patron? Come inside with me and I'll fetch the paperwork. See? I Yeah, but do you actually have that amount of money with you? Do you actually have that? I had it under control. Wait it out here, clever. That sounds concerning. Done and done. Can I get a yeehaw? Uh, right, moving along. Please don't tell me that you actually killed him. Please don't tell me you killed him. Please don't tell me that. And I don't think he did. But please don't tell me that you actually killed him. Let's see what you've got. Take this trusted six shooter as a gift from me. Carefully aim at the dummy and take your shot. Don't worry, it ain't alive or nothing. It's alright, partner. Try again. Mighty fine job. Give it another go. Wait. There you go. One more. This is so weird! I don't like this! Wow. Nice shooting! I'd say you're a natural. I'm impressed, kid. You definitely passed this part of training. I gotta tell you the Sorobra about this. She's gonna be a bit. She's a big doubter when it comes to you. Let's ride on. I love how we just teleported here. Sorobra! Guess what just happened? You locked up another royal guard against their will? I mean, that is what happened. Hey! Feathers was a, was a serious roadblock to all of this. It's only a temporary solution. I don't feel right doing it, I swear. I'm just giving you a hard time. What did you want to tell me instead? Oh, uh, well, um, Clover just passed their first round of training. They're quite the shop suitor. Almost as good as me. Really? A, a child? No, no. Don't disrespect the kid. Clover can hold their own, and then some. I know, I'm, I'm just... I'm very impressed. Oh, hey, I almost forgot about the hat. I have a, a spare somewhere in my house. Clover, wait here while I fetch it. Maybe the, while they wait, you, sh you should get to know them, Saroba. Should be fun, right? Sure. Sounds good. Be right back, partner. Hi. This is totally not awkward at all. Hi. Hi. Tell me truly. Hi. Are you into all of this? No. <clears throat> Sorry that stars dragging you around so much then. This whole thing is like a dream to him. It's kind of goofy, but it is nice to see someone so passionate. I agree, it really is nice to see someone that's passionate. However, passion can go to- Yes. People need to know where to keep their boundaries. And it's clear that North Star is kind of oblivious to this. You wouldn't believe how much his parents took to me about it. Really kind folks who own a farm up north. It's actually very lush there, if you can believe it. And the corn they grow? So good. They used to give my husband, Chujin, baskets full every week. Anyway, I tried off. Where was I? I'm back! Oh god, here we go. 
tokens, I had one just your size and in the same color. It's like destiny or something. Here. Got a nice hat. Wow. I couldn't even tell if it. I couldn't even tell it changed if I were standing from afar. I mean, I mean it didn't change to me, so. Looks great. What do you think, Saroba? It's nice. Isn't it? Well, I'd say this mission was a great success. Go on, and take a break, Clover. I've been waiting for you. I'm gonna see what Flowey has to say about all of this now. Howdy! That's interesting. You know what? Let's just get back to him and just continue on. Because I want to get out of here ASA. Where did Saroba? Saroba, Saroba. Okay, so you changed position for some reason. Where has Saroba gone, though? What the. Okay. I guess she's gone. Let's just talk back with Star then. Howdy, howdy, Carver. Ready for round two? I guess so. Swell. Seeing as the original plans were altered, we got a catching up to do. Let's gather the others. Group up, everyone. In a bit of deja vu here. As you should know. I, 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 as you should, buddy. Thanks to Ace's keen eye for fashion, we took a, l a little detour. Great job there. Thank you, Star. Clover thinks much better. L looks much better now. I agree. Clover's looking like a real raggler. For sure. The new gun is awfully shiny. That's a shake, uh, Mr. Basic. I'm really hoping that you did not murder him. I'm really hoping you did not murder him. I was real tough too. I genuinely think he murdered him. I don't want to believe this, but I genuinely think so. You're gonna send me in to get it? You know I'm the best negotiator. We might bend the rules a bit, but we ain't bandits. Mm hmm, yeah, totally. Let's get mad. Let's get to the mission already. <coughs> right, you are, Ed. What other, mi uh, what other mission would it be than the one we skipped before? Get ready, Clover. Yep, here we go. How dangerous is this jewel? It's time for us to duel! You know what? This reminds me of you, Gear, a lot. <laughs> even though I didn't even watch or. I didn't really watch much of Yugo or play much of Yugo, but I remember this sort of thing. It's some with Joel. Um, <laughs> I didn't even notice that as well. <laughs> you mean duel? That's, that that's what I said. No, you pronounced it with a. Uh, you A sound instead of a OO sound. Buzz, have you been skipping cowboy grammar class? Duel, duel, who cares? Tomato, tomato, potato, potato, and all of that. Y'all need to quit interrupting me so often. Upsets my frontiers and. Okay? Where was I? Oh, yeah, it's time to. T t uh, Participate in a carefully timed shooting competition. Mooch, provide Clover with the designed, designated tool. Here's a BB gun for the duel. I'll uh, take that six shooter off your hat, uh, off your hands for now. Mooch, bring the gun here. That's what I was gonna do, Murray. Get off my back, will ya? All right, it's finally time to head to the. Uh, wait. 
What is it now, Ace? What could possibly be so present to interrupt the mission once again? You forgot the safety classes. G boss. You could have you could you you could have heard Clover. Right. I take responsibility and apologize for the oversight. Bring the classes here already. I'm on the pair with blue flames. Red flames clash with my uniform. Here. Now we're in business. Alrighty, Clover. We're gonna take ten paces and turn to face each other. When you hear the draw sound, grab your gun and shoot me as fast as you can. Here we go. <laughs> How well is this gonna go? Okay. Draw. Ah, oh, too bad. Let's try one more time. <laughs> okay. Wow. Ooh. Stop, stop. Are you okay? Pretty much the opposite of that. Oh, stop. I'm so sorry. Who, who will you give your inheritance to? Not you. Heck. <laughs> <laughs> this is your emotional trauma. Wow. This job ain't all sweat stones and rainbows, you understand? You might end up hurting someone and must carry that weight on your back. How about it didn't scare you? Anyway, you pass. I'll be waiting in the saloon again when you're ready to for the mission three. I'm seeing good things in you, kid. Here's your iron. Also, I'll be needing those glasses. Great. Well, here we go for mission three now, I guess. Halfway done. Halfway done. Okay. They grab so fast, I guess. Sure. Follow me. You know the drill team? Ain't no time to be lazing around. I'm not even going to do the voice acting this time. Hello? Where's everyone? Sorry about this, Clover. I should be... So, what is happening on the west end of town? Um... Would you care to explain? What? Is anyone in danger? Well... No, th they are? By George, this must be an attack from Vengeful Virgil. Vengeful... Very, b b what? Uh, who is that? Sorobo, come on. We drew his wanted poster last month. It's on the news board. You helped me find the thumbtacks and everything. Um. Oh. Yeah. Well, you better go stop them then. What are you waiting for? That's the spirit. Let's put a stop to this clover. A very questionable mission indeed, okay? Uh, um... Huh. You sure you saw something traveling over here? Look down. Uh. Oh! How the fuck did that happen? What the fuck? Hey, I didn't sign up for this. Get me out of here. Ed, keep it down. I need to focus. How in the heck did, uh, will I solve this colossal conundrum? Just fucking untie them. And risk being tricked into a baby trap! Touching those ropes is exactly what Virgil wants. What? This is scary, Star. I'm afraid you must choose which track to the. Uh, okay. Yeah, choose it. Mooch, are you, you are fucking dead to me. And let's start choosing you instead. That's cold. <gasps> this is all to over women. I, I, I can't do it. Then have Clover choose. Of course. Clover don't have no emotional attachment to y'all. Should be simple. Don't you think this is a bit much? 
Nah, it's easy. Choose to leave the track as is. It won't be your fault, but many monsters get hurt. Choose to change the track. It would be your hand, I, uh, but only Ed gets. Okay, so. Okay, okay, okay. So, if I change the track. <laughs> Then the yeah, others survive. But if I don't change the track, then Ed survives. Um, not as much of a sacrifice. What did I do to deserve this? We're out of time. If only we could have untied everyone. If only. You gotta choose now, Clover. Um. I don't know what which one to choose, so I'm just gonna. Which one did I choose? I don't even know which one I chose. Huh? What? Ouch! You owe me for this. Clover, I thought we were friends. <laughs> yeah, I'm okay with it. <laughs> Clover likes... I, I chose that one? I thought I chose the other one. I okay. <laughs> now, now. This decision was a tough one. Having the casualty be on your hands is a lot to handle mentally. There's a lot more to it than that, Star. This is a deep scenario that requires a lot of thinking. We don't have time for thinking. This is a test of judgment and clever past. Past? How? Exactly? Uh, quit being so technical about everything, Murray. Clever saved Ed. That's pretty good. I can't say if that was an insult or not. Anyway, I'll see you at the usual spot, kid. Come to me when you're ready for the final mission. <sighs> See you around. Hey, is anyone gonna actually untie us? Uh. Dang. Ooh. Okay, my patience is only so strong, Clever. I hope you're not planning to actually stay here. These puzzles are below you. I highly suggest that you make a run for it when the time's right. Try not to let yourself get distracted from the real mission. Don't worry, Flowey, I'm not getting myself distracted like at all whatsoever. I've been trying to find a way to get out of here for a very, very long time already. <sighs> well, I guess it's time for the final mission now. Man, am I excited for this. Have you done everything you wanted? Cars and bandits, sit. Yes. Let's get going then. Final call. Get on over here. Are y'all ready? Actually, there's something we wanted to talk about. Yeah, about the general work environment. Maybe later. Let's keep moving. Oh, for fuck's sakes. So clever. I actually tricked you. There's no fourth mission. Well, I mean, there used to be, but... We cut it out for the, 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 the okay. Anyway, you passed everything. You are now the proud deputy of this fine. I'm sure, but I, I don't want it. I want out. Like ASAP. Wait, deputy? I thought this was the normal stuff I spot on the team. Clover is too special and it's good for. How am I so special? Star, this is hardly fair. Life ain't always fair in the wild east, buckle. They pass their training like anyone else. That was, that was training. We barely did anything. That last mission especially was awful. Calm down, will you? You're killing my good mood. I have to run to the mines to get Clover's badge made. I was too busy with everything that is to my mind. You five have fun. I'll be right back.
This is just peachy. You get this attention and all. How come you waltz in here and start instantly makes you deputy? We didn't get this kind of treatment. We had to go through weeks of lasso lessons. Lessons. Ha 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 For me to become part of the team. Star made me walk around with a snake in my boot for a week. The rubber, but the rashes it gave me were unbearable. Yeah, and he made me pickpocket monsters by the oasis. So I didn't make you do that. Smiley face? You know what? This ain't fair to any of us. Clover needs a challenge. We need to see if they're truly worthy of joining our squad. Finally, some real excitement! Fight it for it, here we come! Oh god! <laughs> I don't want to. So you're the new deputy, eh? Then you shouldn't have a problem dodging this. I don't want this! I don't want any of this! Why am I getting any of this? Why? Man. Okay, so here we go. We're back here. I was wondering, like, is it gonna, like, I don't know, pause in the middle of the fight, or are we just gonna go through it? But finally, like, I didn't want to kill any of them, because like, they don't deserve death in any way, shape, or form. They decided to fight me. I didn't decide to fight them. So, what in the actual gosh darn tarnation is happening in here? We felt your training was lackluster. So we gave Clover a real challenge. I'm disappointed in you four. Eight weeks of lessons for this? I ought to lock you away with feathers. Stop. What's going on? You've been... different. A real meanie. It's true. This hasn't been any fun. What are you... What are y'all blubbering on about? This is the most alive this town has ever been. Why does everything have to be a spectacle, huh? Yeah, why does everything have to be a spectacle? I miss the old North Star, the fearless leader. The monster who could make their own fun in the little things. Who doesn't like just having fun with just the little things? That, that's the best part of life. The best part of life. Fun with the little things. This new star is selfish, selfish and reckless. Or should I call you by your real name? Should I? Star Lol? Why you? Why you little? What's with all the shouting? What's happening? It's in my posse. Don't respect me no more. It's not that. We just want you to take it down a notch. You can't just throw us around for this human business. That isn't what friends do, Star. Hmm. I know what all of this is really about. Y'all are just full of envy, overflowing with it. Clover's shut circles around you and you just can't accept it. Clover has nothing to do with this. It's you. No, Star's totally right. Clover's super skilled at everything. In fact, I think they carry the whole squad. They could carry the whole squad in their own. Who needs us when you've got a powerhouse deputy? What are you saying? I'm saying that I'm done. I resign from the Fighty Five, okay? Really now? It will still be the Fighty Five without you, so go ahead, I guess. I, I, I'm leaving too. I don't want to work under a big-headed sheriff. Seems like life dealt you a bad hand, Star. I'm following them. Dang. Sorry, Star. Please work on yourself. Forgiveness is only one apology away. Fine! I was considering firing y'all anyway. That was, that, that's such a cope. Sorry, but you, 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 underst you understand, right? This, this is being ridiculous. Starlo? They're right. You have 
changed a lot from the monster I once knew. I tried to brush it off as you having fun at first, but this wild east thing has damaged your personality. I want to see the real Starlo. Uh, that's no star to you. Well, everyone is gone. I got no posse, no friends. I, I need to think. I can, I can fix this. Howdy. I was afraid things would escalate. I think you are not fully used to by now. This is probably a good time to get out of here. It's all gone way too far, don't you think? Whatever happens, I wish you luck, clever. <clears throat> Damn. Okay. We made it out. Howdy! I was hoping Starlo ran into his parents or something. Looks like you'll have to confront him. Do what you do best. I'm always rooting for you. Okay. Well. Since I've saved it, that's going to be it of this episode. Now, this episode is probably most likely going to be a whole two hours. But I'm so glad. I'm so glad I finally left that area. So, thank you so much for watching, everybody. Hope you have all enjoyed. And I shall see you guys next time. Peace out, everybody.